through math and science. In this video, let's go over the factors of 108, and I'll show you a simple technique for finding all the factors of a number. Okay, 108 is a composite number, which means that it's divisible by numbers other than 1 and itself. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write 1 and 108, because I know 1 times 108 equals 108. Next, I will try to find the numbers between 1 and 108 that multiply together to equal 108. So the first number is 2. Does 2 go into 108? Yes, I know it ends in an even number, so 2 times 54 is 108. Next, does 3 go into 108? And yes, it does. 3 times 36 equals 108. And I continue. Does 4 go into 108? And yes, 4 times 27 equals 108. Does 5 go into 108? No, 5 does not. And I know that because it doesn't end in a 5 or 0. Does 6 go into 108? Yes, it does. 6 goes into 108 uh, 18 times. And now, does 7 go into 108? No, 7 does not go into 108. 8 does not go into 108, but 9 goes into 108, and 9 times 12 is 108. Now, I keep closing this gap, so does 10 go into 108? No. Uh, does 11 go into 108? No. So now I'm back to the 12. So at this point, I know I have all the factors of 108, and they are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18, 27, 36, 54, and 108. Now I'll show you a trick to make sure you can double check that you have all the factors. So let's find the prime numbers that multiply together to equal 108. And I like to use a factor tree. 2 goes into 108 54 times. Circle the 2 because it is prime. I'll stay with 2. 2 times 27 is 54. Circle the 2 because it is prime. Now 3 times 9 is 27. Circle the 3 because it is prime. And now 3 times 3 equals 9. Circle both of these because they are prime. So the prime factors are 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 3. Now here's the trick. I can rewrite this as 2 squared and rewrite 3 cubed. So I take the exponent and add 1. So 2 plus 1 is 2. The exponent 3 here, because it's cubed, add 1, and that becomes 4. Now, why did I write the 2 there? So let's start over again. 2 plus 1 is 3. The exponent 3, I will add 1, and that is 4. So that equals, when you multiply these together, 12. So that tells you that you will have 12 factors in 108. So let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I know that this will be the factors of 108. And as a bonus, here are the prime numbers that multiply together to equal 108. If you need more information on finding factors of numbers, this playlist should help. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.